Futurama helped develop mathematical knowledge as we know it. In the episode The Prisoner of Benda, the professor invents a machine that is able to switch the minds of two users. The catch is those same two people can't switch with each other again. They can, however, still switch with other people. The entire Planet Express crew, as well as a few others, all manage to have their minds switched up into a different body. The professor in the body of Bender, with two of the Globetrotters, manage to figure out how to get everyone back into their original bodies. No matter how many people had their minds switched up in the machine, it would only take two additional people to switch everyone's mind back to their body of origin. Even given no two minds can switch with each other twice. The episode shows this fix happening in 13 steps. However, some eagle-eyed fans were able to point out that it could have happened in 9. How? Well, the Futurama writing team actually wrote a mathematical theorem to prove that only two additional minds were needed to swap everyone back into their proper bodies. It was called the Futurama Theorem. The theorem was designed to have the two extra participants, labeled X and Y, to be able to switch with everyone until they are back to normal, leaving X and Y switched. However, since X and Y never switched before, they were able to at the end, being the last event in the sequence. While a small theorem in the grand scheme of things, 